Hello friends, welcome to automationtalks.com. This is video 22 of this Selenium tutorial video series. In this video, I will talk about check the presence of element on the web page in Selenium web driver. So during automation, many times uh, I, it is required to check the presence of web element. Let us say this is the demo web shop of Tricentize. So if let us say uh, in your test case, if you want to check a particular element has appeared let us say if you want to check okay if this login field is appeared on the screen or not then how to check that first what you need to do is you need to identify this locator locator of this element so this x path okay let me inspect Okay, let me write the X path. Fine, this is the unique one. So I uh, so let us say my aim is to check if this particular element is appeared on the screen or not, is displayed on the screen or not. So for that, I got the X path from this. Uh, for this element by using this my fire path now how to do okay and this uh, post is on my blog automationtalks.com under selenium tutorial selenium web driver you can find the detailed <coughs> code over here so the first thing what you need to do is navigate to the website then uh, we will find it by using the list okay so what we will do is let us let me go to eclipse in eclipse let me create new class test test presence of object fine okay and let me copy the code of this launching browser because I, I need to set this property for the launching chrome browser let me create one method for this So what I'm doing is I, I have set the property to launch a Chrome driver and I'm launching a Chrome browser. Fine. Then what I'll do, okay, I'll, I'll copy the next other things as well because this will remain same. I'm navigating to demo web shop, then maximizing, then implicit weight. Fine. I want to uh, navigate to demo web shop. I have navigated to demo web shop by using this then maximize the window and then implicit weight for to achieve synchronization now what is my aim my aim is to check if login link appear appeared on screen on page it's fine this is my aim so what we can do is we will get it into the list so you should know a little bit about Java so list list is nothing but uh, it is a kind of array where you store uh, like all links let us say all objects or web elements or something like that right so what we will do is nothing it's very simple so what we will do is uh, we will use if statement and what what is our aim my aim is my aim is to check if this login button appeared on the screen or not so for this what I'll do is I will okay I'll, I'll write the code first what we'll do is I will get that element into the list so how to get element into the list driver dot find for uh, for a list it should be find elements because I am trying to get a multiple elements right by X path and what is my X path sorry this is my X path Now what I want to do is now this driver dot find elements by this 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 now this data will come into the list now what I want to check is I want to check the size of the list if size of the list is not equal to zero right what the what does this mean is this is the list 
right this is a list and in this list this is the list of this particular x path that means if this particular um, particular link is appeared on the screen that means in this list there will be some value of the web element and its size will not be a zero right so um, what i'm doing is i'm checking its size size of the list if it is not equal to zero then whatever you want to do is element is present on screen else element is missing right you can write your code like whatever you want right so that's it this is very simple what you're doing is I'm, I'm getting I'm getting the web elements into a list and I'm checking its size if it is not equal to zero that means element is present on the screen now let us run okay I have not added a, it as a test ng test so let me do that Okay, the Chrome browser is launching. It is navigating to demo web shop. Maximized. And your test should pass. Can you see? Test is passed. That means it is showing element is present on a screen. Now let me just change the xpath login one. It is not existing. All right. So let me change the xpath to login one, and let me kill the driver. Now let me run this. Now this time uh, it should give element missing because that element is not present on the screen. okay what is saying is element is missing test execution is finished and element is missing because this particular x path is not found that is why the list is empty and that is element is missing okay so that's how we can check if the element is present or not okay there, there are multiple methods there are multiple uh, selenium methods as well uh, selenium what i can say uh, yeah selenium methods to check a particular uh, object is present or uh, on the web page or not We'll try to cover them later, but this is the very simplest method and very useful method we use. So that's it I have for this uh, checking presence of element on the web page in Selenium WebDriver. Thanks for watching. Do subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks.